Edward J. Emerson, and it is 1931, December to be exact, and we are pretty much designing our 1935 cars. Now, this is the end of the model year, and we'll have to start updating our model. But this here is our Q2S Coupe is by Dove Industries and pretty much we started this company out in Mexico but then Mexico ended up having a conflict in the area and when we spun the company off um, it was unable to sustain any sort of manufacturing because number one factories are expensive and number two um, the factory that we ended up um, constructing for them was in a conflict area so this is a 2 plus 2 coupe this vehicle was just redesigned about three years ago it has the underpinnings of a luxury based vehicle or luxury based performance coupe and it seats up to about four people and Dove Industries is a company, like I said, we have a manufacturing plant in, well actually two manufacturing plants in Australia. And in those two plants, um, we produce the Phaeton, which is a Q3S coupe, and this model here, which is the Q2S, and then in 1933 we are going to venture into the sedan market full-size sedan market so we'll have a q5 s sedan and so dove industries a unique company because it comes in like i said on the heels of allure so it doesn't have the it doesn't have a dedicated motor to it. Um, like I said, all of the underpinnings are Emerson Allure. And instead of Emerson Allure being spread out across the country, we ended up developing this vehicle um, to spearhead the Coupe 2 Plus 2 because we have a couple of different companies that are going to start coming onto the scene. Number one, a Porsche is going to be coming onto the scene shortly. And we needed a vehicle that was not as polished as Allure. Because Allure is actually moving up the model trail. And it pretty much caters to the wealthy. And this vehicle here is going to sit somewhere in between um, Allure and Emerson Motors. And Emerson Motors, of course, is our mainstream company. And it is based upon a front-wheel drive platform. This here is a front-engine rear-wheel drive platform, air suspension, but they, but all of the vehicles in the product lineup are only going to be four cylinders. Um, it is a very unique car, and it has actually gone through a couple of different designs. And the first design is here. Well, the first design is actually here and you can see how this vehicle um, and this is a 1929 so we have the vents on the side the raised um, rear lights and then we ended up redesigning it just a little bit in 1930 to kind of give it just a little bit of a different look. And then in 1931, we incorporated 
a ventilation system on the vehicle but then that wasn't necessarily the look that we were looking for so we ended up taking that design and ended up um, producing a 2 plus 2 um, coupe for Emerson motors and the problem was was that with producing this vehicle for Emerson Motors we did not have a rear-wheel drive platform so the Dove Industries was on a rear-wheel drive platform and instead of taking the Allure platform and taking it all the way down to Emerson Motors, we ended up developing the Dove Industries vehicle. And they are pretty much mirror image, but what we ended up doing was discontinuing the Emerson Motors brand vehicle, um, primarily because of cost. Um, the Emerson Motors was going to cost just a little bit too much because it was going to be the only vehicle that was on that platform. And with only having a vehicle that is so much different than all of the other vehicles, um, it didn't make much sense. Now we could have taken the Allure platform and pretty much given it to the Emerson Motors but the problem with that is is that then we'll dilute the Emerson Allure platform and we wanted to kind of keep the Emerson Motors more of a mainstream so this is our current model here and it was just redesigned and it's going to run up until 1935 so pretty much this will be the last model year for it and then we'll kind of tweak the design just a little bit to go on and carry us into the 1936 model year or we may keep it kind of pretty much the same 